Welcome back to Dark Corner's Advent Calendar 2018. Housed in a massive submarine swallowing ship is our full run of James Bond movie posters, and we're leafing through them in strictly non-chronological order to count you down to Christmas. Though everyone has their personal favourite Bond, the general consensus is that Sean Connery wore it best. The actor in whom the spy's combination of thuggish brutality and suave elegance was best balanced. Mr Smith and Weston, and you've had your six. While all the films aren't classics, no one else has equaled that opening run of Dr. No from Russia With Love and Goldfinger. With all this in his corner, it's good to take him down a peg from time to time. I was gonna say, I don't know what they were thinking, but I kind of do. It's not just the bevy of oriental beauties posed seductively around Bond, it's Connery himself cocking a very Roger Moore-ish eyebrow, as if to say, I'm doing them all later. There's a vague feeling that the girl on the end holding a gun has been added just to remind us this is an action film and not softcore porn. Admittedly, there is a smaller secondary image of Bond, but even in this he's undermined by wearing a silly hat. Of course, this wasn't the only poster design, but to be honest, shouldn't he be flying that thing rather than striking a pose? God alone knows what's going on here. Bond has always existed in a heightened world, but this feels like an open admission that things were just starting to get a bit silly. And while in the future the franchise would learn to harness that, this is still too close to the more serious spy films of the early years, and I just don't think they knew how to market it, and so fell back on the oldest rule sex sells. Thanks for watching. Dark Corner's Advent Calendar 2018 will return tomorrow. Bond was, and to a degree remains, a franchise that walks a line between the serious and the silly. What are your favourite moments where it just went too far? Let us know in the comments below.